hello my pretties i'm on here to do this past life read i've been picking up a lot of asian energy um for months now probably like two or three months shorty i'ma only tell you this once you the endless bop but i don't know and for your loving i'ma die hard like bruce willis anyway i think i met him in the sky when i was a geisha he was a samurai Somehow I understood him when he spoke Thai. Never spoke lies and he never broke fly. <coughs> um, yeah, that's what I thought. There's a woman here um, who it seemed like she was being persecuted, okay, back in Asia. It feels like she was being persecuted because of her spiritual beliefs or something that she may have been walking around telling people. There's, I just heard water into wine, okay? Um, I feel like I just heard astronomical. I feel like there were things. This lady is ch challenging authority. And it may have to do with religion. They're telling me that she was um, told that she had to leave. She could have been challenging some sort of religious leader. Um, I feel like um, she was ran up out of the country or, or something like that. Um, she could have been a healer. This is Jesus type energy. Who is this? I don't know. But she um upset people that were in power. If y'all know this story, let me know what the what the hell is going on here. So we have phobias and karmic relationship. Okay. This woman could have been in a relationship with somebody in power or something like that. Or she could have been betra betrayed. Okay, because I feel like whoever she was in a relationship is, is right here. So this person with the chariot and the fool, this person could have been the one that screamed, Witch! Witch! You know what I'm saying? When he didn't get his way. Yeah, you see this energy of imprisonment or slavery? think it's time we should make up baby i feel it's time for us to get back together we make the best of things oh baby when we're together i don't know why i'm singing that y'all this could have I, I don't i don't know show me what that show me what that's about this man could have been abusive to her so this is about a reconciliation. I feel like whoever this man is, he let her go or she let him go. He wanted her to trust him again. I feel it's time we should make up, baby. This lady could have been a nurse. She could have nursed people back to the war or some shit like that. Nurse people back to health in some sort of war. Could this be like Vietnam? I don't damn know. But this is some past life stuff. I feel like this man was a burden to her. Like, for some reason, I feel like she was to blame for everything. But he wanted, he, I feel like they, they broke up. He wanted her to come back and trust him. Yeah, with this rebirth and change. Okay, so what happened next? I don't like this. Because I feel like he fed her to the wolves or some shit like that. This is a, there's an evil, damn, they said uh, satanic, Lord have mercy. Yeah, there's an evil, um, there is an evil spiritualist here, okay? What's the relation between her and the evil spiritualist? What's, what's the, that, was that her man or... Was her man just a part of it? This feel like some. This her, I'm gonna tell you in a minute. Yeah. Um. This is just somebody I feel like who got into the person who she was seeing's head. Okay. Um. And told him to do some things. I feel like it. It feels like this leader or the spiritual teacher, whoever he is, he had reign over the whole or dominion over you know a large uh, number of people over the collective. Okay.
this woman, I feel like she started going around. Yeah, I don't like that. She could have been speaking against him or um, she could have been not bowing down to him like everybody else did. There's something about conflicting information that she would receive in relation to her dreams and some shit that he was saying. And I feel like she might have spoke on it. Like she was raging against the machine and, and, and speaking against the powers that be. And for that, she lost everything, okay? And she was attacked. That's what I get. And that's why this energy of phobias is here and imprisonment and slavery. She needed to shut up. I feel like a whole collective of people was against her and she felt alone. There's something here about how in the background he was stealing her energy. This is a spiritual leader or a spiritual teacher that everybody bowed down to. Um... First of all, I'm hearing her lover sold her out because he was forever indebted or just he praised this, this te spiritual teacher, Alita, so much. How dare you go against the grand high, blah, 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 right? And she like, well, I had a dream and they told me some other shit. God told me I seen some other shit. So, you know what I mean? He's not that great to me or whatever the case is. She could have been going around healing people with something she learned from a dream. I don't know. And the men in power, the spiritual, the spiritual people in power, they wanted things to be how they want how they wanted it to be i'm hearing something specifically about a fire or some sort of catastrophic ev event that happened where it was the, it was orchestrated by this particular spiritualist or whoever he is uh, uh emperor or whatever the fuck i don't know okay but he orchestrated some sort of catastrophic event and then and then made it like he was some sort of hero or he didn't have nothing to do with it whatever like if it was some natural occurrence i'm, I'm literally hearing a fire She knew it was him or she knew something was fishy. This, this chick just too smart for her own good. That was a problem. You see this control and innocence. This is how this man, this is how this man felt about her pure soul. You know what I mean? And he needed to control her because you're not going to go out here speaking against or, um, you know, whether it's purposefully or what, if I say the fire happened by damn accident, OK, don't you go telling people out here that you had a dream that there may this fire may have been set purposely. You get what I'm saying? She was speaking against him or raging against some sort of machine innocently. And they didn't like that. She was healing people that may have got sick from a fire or a war or whatever the case is. But the powers that be wanted things to be exactly how they were. They were acting like they was looking for help, okay? This could be like the, the, the country or the city or the province or whatever. The uh, You know, the people were in need. And this spiritual teacher or this leader or this emperor or whatever could have been acting like they were looking for um, some sort of uh, help, help, aid, help, aid, and relief where really, okay, there was some corrupt shit going on in the background. So, you know, you can't just be having her out here healing people and shit and knowing things that she don't have no business knowing. And that's what that was. They tried to drown her. I just heard, Lord have mercy. They tried to drown her. I just heard treason. She was accused of something. Show me this. What? What? She was accused of some shit. Somebody could have died in this woman's care or something like that, that she was trying to heal or something. And I feel like they blamed her for it. What? I feel like they're saying she was manipulating people or something like that. Whatever she was doing, they was trying to create rumors and speak against whatever the fuck she was doing. What did I say? Projecting. What did I say? Trying to put a label on her, saying she was something that she was not. That's what they was doing. She was only helping with this energy of sharing. She was only trying to protect and serve. And the powers that be was upset. If you are going through something, um, you know what I'm saying? This is like a witch hunt or something like that. Um, so there's that. Um, some of you guys may be experiencing it, this from a, a past life that you went through in Asia is what it felt like. Especially with this energy of travel coming out. So what's the end result? What do we need to expect? What's Okay, so hope, optimism, and new beginnings. I feel like you defeated whatever this is. 
Okay, I feel like in this lifetime, you're going through this again. And this time, you gotta get up, stand up. Stand up for your rights. You see this um, energy of ascendant masters and family tree. We have expansion and legacy. I feel like you won. Okay, you defeated it. You want to bomb ball. You want to G with the big boss? That's how I feel like you made it to big boy status, ascendant master status, okay? I feel like the ascendant masters are now, you know, um, it feels like they're welcoming you, okay? Like, all right, girl, you did it, okay? You figured out the hidden truth, something that was unknown. You figured out something about, I just heard your family, or you figured out something about your lineage, or... um. It's so crazy because I think I told y'all before, um, I have Filipino in my, in my lineage. I didn't know. I did the test and I figured, I found that shit out. I said, oh, okay, wow. Um, <clears throat> yeah, it's time to move on and let go. You're being free from whatever this past, past life energy is, okay? So, uh, you, you know, you're being told to accept, you know, who it is that you are and, 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 and forgive and forget whatever the situation is. I feel like you came into this life and you went through the same shit but uh, you know this time you may have handled it differently i don't i don't know i don't i don't know what you know came became of her so we have divine presence okay the force of love and creation this feels good you guys this feels good like you know it went better this time yeah you guys get uncontrolled y'all feelings visions and shit like that you're being blessed with it okay and they want you to make very good use of what this is because I don't know if it, if you had to do this over because you may have felt victim to the shit th that they was trying to do to you in the past life. But this time it felt like you defeated them, okay? So, um, yeah. Some of you guys got fairies working on your behalf as well. They said you got men mad. I don't know what that means. There's a man that's mad. This could be the, the, the person, okay? But he has to now leave your life. I just heard, nah. Y'all need to cleanse y'all energy, okay? Go to theprettyoracle.com, get you a bath, go um, get you a bundle, okay? Um, some spiritual warfare candles and get to work. Um, I feel like um, this shit is over. If somebody trying to come back into your life, tell them no, okay? This person trying to continue the contract. It's over, Grover. It's over, Grover, okay? Somebody wants to continue... Some sort of contract. I feel it's time we should make up, baby. This person just want to get back into your energy to, 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 to make you have to repeat this. So they could defeat you, betray you again to make you have to repeat this cycle all over. Somebody want to win, 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 win you over when the shit is already done. Okay, you guys? I hope that helped.